Welcome back. In this video, we're going to show you how to use the common line punching in SigmaNest. When you bring in a part into SigmaNest, make sure you set the part as a common cut part in the part parameters. Let's create a new task. Go to the task parameters and make sure you have common line cutting turned on. To set your kerf lookup, you will need to know what kind of tools you have in your tool library. Now let's go ahead and auto nest. Next, click on the auto NC. Let's go to the common line punching tab and enable it. Pick a strategy. Let's remove our duplicate tool hits, if there's any. Then choose a merge direction. Next, let's put in some tabs. Go to the Auto tab and make our tab size 0 .03 for corners. In the Advanced NC tab, make sure you have your Auto Punching enabled and click OK. Next, the Tool Sort window will appear. For this nest, I will just use the Snake Horizontally and Vertically options for my tool hits. When finished, click OK. Then simulate your NC. And that's all there is to it. 